Hey yo, what's good, YouTube? It's Black Mamba checking in again with you. Uh, this video is gonna be more about me opening up my rewards pack, specifically just player rewards pack from the domination. Uh, luckily, I was able to beat the first domination, and I got Jason Kidd. Oh my goodness. This card is one of the best cards I've played with on my team so far. He's just so smooth. As you can see, my, this is my team right here. I can't lose. I mean, granted, I'm going to lose some games, but hopefully I go like last year. I won way more than I lost. But I think this year will be better competition with all the cheese factors out. <laughs> no more Cheesecake Factory, right? That's dope. Now I get a fair shot. But so far from domination only. Domination only. That's what I want to be specific about. Domination only. I did do a 100,000k pack opening. Uh, the launch of NBA 2K16 on my live stream. And I ended up getting some good players. But I also got some players from sniping. Like this Dirk I mentioned before in previous videos. Zach Randolph. About four Chris Pauls and two Kyries. But this is about domination of rewards. What I've gotten so far. Beating the San Antonio Spurs. I got this Kawhi Leonard. It's a great card. I get a defensive lineup. More than likely I'm going to have DeAndre, Blake, Kawhi. And Jimmy get buckets. You know I gotta have Jimmy get buckets and Clay Thompson. That's gonna be my defensive team that I'm gonna assemble. Hopefully in the future I'll have some gameplay so you can see how I set up my defense and how I'm able to shut shut down, not only shut down but lock people up. That's why I like to holler out, lock up, throw away the key. <laughs> but yeah, let's get back to the players that I got. Kawhi Leonard. And I've also gotten this Blake Griffin. He is an absolute monster. Monster. I tell you, a monster. I also got this LaMarcus Aldridge. So I know people have been complaining, saying that they haven't really got good cards. But I don't know. I just, I've, <laughs> I've just been on a good streak lately. I also got this Mark Gasol when I beat the Grizzlies. So, Again, guys, instead of spending money, I also got the Hassan Whiteside. You see, I used him to death. He don't even have any more contracts. And I got this Brooke Lopez as well. And I also got this Chris Bosh. And this Kevin Love. And this Cal Lowry. And this Eric Bledsoe. Let me go through my goals so I can make sure. Yeah, just Cal, Brooke, Eric, Hassan. Oh, I got that Andrew Wiggins from a pack opening. Definitely get that card, guys. You'll love him. I got Jimmy Butler from my career, and he was worth it. He's one of my favorite players. But also, now, let's go to this reward. Wish me luck. I feel like I'm going to get another goal, right? This is the historic domination, so... Uh... Mad Max. Uh, yeah, I don't think he can do too much, but hey. It's another collection added on to getting my um, Ray Allen soon, so. But definitely sell that duplicate Timberwolves. Come on, you gotta give me something. Let's go with the Hornets. Just don't give me Muggsy Balls. I don't think this year he can be effective. Please don't give me Muggsy. Please. Johnny Newman. Mm. Really not that great of a guy, but I'll take it. And let's see. Oh, the Trailblazers. That'll be dope, right? I get Steve Smith. I don't really need Pippen right now. Silas. Damon. 
I liked him in University of or Arizona. I'm sorry, I almost said Oregon. There've been some Arizona Wildcats, like real man about that. Let me try. Spires. Uh, come on, you gotta give me something. Oh my goodness, nah, Vinny Nell. Ah, come on, this, this is trolling, man. Who wants Vinny Dell Negro on that team? Ah, can't be serious. You know what? Things didn't work out the way that I wanted to, so I'm gonna open up one pack. Hopefully, um, I can get a goal, and that'll be well worth my time, and also yours. And I didn't get one. Austin Revis. I have no use for him on my team. <laughs> to be honest, let me try again. Come on, 2K. Help your boy out. Give me something. Uh-oh. It's trouble now. Wow. That's bad. That's real bad. Right? Also, I want to give an update on my methods on sniping. If you remember the previous video, I said I sniped this Chris Paul. Well, what I did, since it was so early, I would wait until the price jump up because I knew that that would happen. Like I told people. There were so many Chris Pauls in the auction. He was going for literally 18K. And as you can see, he's going up. He's going up. And there's not that many of them. The lowest card is 34000 That's a tremendous profit. Tremendous. I know you're saying there's only one. You only have one left. What did happen to him? Well, I sold one. So you do the math. 10% of 43000 and I only pay 500 for them. That equals a nice amount of MT. So definitely, guys, continue to snipe. Practice. You might not get it, but eventually you will. And when you get it, it's like money in the bank. You can go out and shop all you want for players. You can spend, you can buy whatever you want. You don't even have to worry about it because you know at the end of the day, as long as you got 500 to 1,000, you can begin sniping and you'll get your money back. Hopefully I have some more historic pack open rewards and we can actually get a good one. I've been kind of going slow and going off and on, but I think I'm gonna start going hard to try and hurry up and get this over with. We still got some teams to go. And it's fairly simple with having Dirt and that Kobe Bryant in my lineup, post phase city, double team city, whole L1. And another tip that I wanna give you before I go guys, because a lot of people take things for granted because they know how to do it. As a matter of fact, let me put in a player I've just fallen in love with, with playing with. Of course, he'll never take Kobe's spot, but he just, he's, to me, he's the best point guard on the game, period. But there were a few people that were coming into the stream, and they were question like how are you doing that I don't understand like, I can't do that if you play a lot of people online they normally uh, doing a little quick crossover or just running around with turbo 
having really no idea what they're doing. I'm gonna try and show you. Well, not try. I'm gonna definitely show you how to do it. Oh, what happened to my 2K? Well, I'll fix it later. The guy with the best handles on the game. But here's what you want to do. You want to hold R2 for turbo, right? And then you just want to flick it. You don't want to hold it. You want to flick R2 while holding. I'm sorry. <laughs> you want to flick the right stick while holding R2. Because if you hold the right stick, this will happen. You'll shoot it. And I made it. Wow. But what you want to do is you want to hold R2, flick it to the right. Watch this. Oh my goodness. Shake City. Flick it to the left. Oh my. You don't know how many times people play Computer D and I light up. Flick it down. Flick it up. Hey, that sounds kind of like a song, right? I'm going to have to copyright that. Nah, I'm just playing. But that's what you want to do, guys. This will help a lot because I'm sure a lot of people online has been experiencing off-ball computer D all game. Definitely want to get this card, and he's going for a cheap. He's the best point guard in the game. Defensively, you're going to struggle. You're definitely going to struggle with him. His defensive stats aren't that well, so that's why you want to get a big man. DeAndre Jordan, white side. Just in case if you get beat off the dribble, he'll come and he'll help you out. So I, I hope these tips are helping you get better in my team because this year it's a lot of competition. Not only is it a lot of competition, it's different competition because a lot of people, they're resorting to play, playing off-ball defense, which happened last year, but with the defense being so hard now, it's hard to get by people. So I hope you like this video, and if you do, please inject your venom on that like button. I'm out.